All right, welcome to episode number 93 of Christian Michael's Figure Review, and today we will be unboxing the latest offering from the Marvel Collector Corps. Uh, the first box was based on the Avengers Age of Ultron movie. The second box was based on the Ant-Man movie. And now today, it's based on the Marvel Secret Wars. No, that's not a movie that's coming out. It's a series of comic books. I don't know anything about the Secret Wars. The teaser trailer uh, for this box showed Thor's hammer, so I'm hoping there's a lot of cool Thor-related stuff in here. But I really don't know. I am not into comic books. Meaning I don't read them. I don't know like a lot of comic book backstory. I just like the characters. I like watching cartoons. Animated features. Live action movies. That's what I'm into. But we'll see if this box holds any excitement. Or if it's just stuff that I don't get. And it will be on eBay. Within 20 minutes of me unboxing. So let me try to find something to open this with. Of course, there's always some nice artwork on it. UPS had to slap a label right there. And you can see the Secret Wars on that side. Marvel Collector Core. And the same thing on that side. So let's cut this bad boy open. And here is the patch that comes uh this month and the pin for this month okay and there's the comic book paneling which has become a staple of opening these boxes you get some comic book paneling as you open it welcome to the Marvel Collector Core alright first thing is first we have a t-shirt here take a look at it here the Marvel Secret Wars and that's uh, some characters in the uh, style of a Funko Pop I'm not gonna uh, I'm gonna say that's Iron Man that's probably the chick Thor I think is there a new Captain America? There probably is. I've read that somewhere. And that's the new Spider-Man. So I'm really like lost on this. Here is the comic book. And this is definitely the Chick Thor. They said that there was like a re... I don't know what if I'm using the terminology correctly. But like a rebranding of Marvel. Where there was a female Thor. A black Captain America. And Spider-Man is half... Spanish and half black or I'm not really sure um, but here's the comic book and there are two pops in here we get two pops the Secret Wars Thor which is Jane Foster I believe so you can see that because this is the female Thor right this cannot be a man Thor because there's there's boobies there so you got that in another exclusive pop this is Miles Morales spider-man so there you go so you get two exclusive pops in this box there was other like this is from the Ant-Man box I don't, this is like a little mini bobblehead and then it came with a pop and then the Avengers box came with adorbs, which I don't even know what the fuck that is. And I don't even know where it is. And they came with a pop. But this comes with two pops. So, there they are. I can't say I'm particularly excited about either one of them. Because I don't really know much about Miles Morales Spider-Man or the female Thor. But, maybe I'll read the comic book and get a little... You know, backstory on them. So, there they are. This is what you're basically paying for. Is the two exclusive pops. So, this is what I just paid $30 for. Normally, it would be really exciting to get two exclusive pops. But, like I said, not big into the comics. And I don't really know a lot about these two characters. Only this is the new Spider-Man. And this is the new Thor. So, 
maybe some of you out there that have uh, gotten this box, this will be a lot more exciting to you. To me personally, I'm not as nearly excited as I was for the Ant-Man box. Not that I knew a lot about Ant-Man, but it was um, to get you pumped for the movie that was coming out, which I thought was a good idea, and a lot of cool stuff, and the movie was pretty cool, so, you know, we'll see. We'll see what we're going to do with these, but right now, two exclusive pops, the comic book, and the t-shirt that I threw over there. So, that is the third edition of the Marvel Collector Corp. Uh, if I can remember to do so, I might just cancel it and then uh, re-up, you know, because I'm sure you can re-up, uh, just resubscribe when something comes out that you're interested in, because, like, honestly, none of this stuff truly excites me. But it maybe excites you. They went more towards the comic book fans instead of the movie fans this month, which you can't really blame them for. Because you can't have movie-based boxes all the time since there's not movies coming out all the time. So, that's episode 93. You know, we just went through the Marvel Collector Core box number 3. So, rate, comment, share, and subscribe. And be sure to follow me on Twitter at Christian underscore 973. And we will see you in episode 94.